Hello guys, in this video we are going to be constructing the first angle orthography projection of this particular block. So first of all we are going to be drawing our horizontal line as we can see. Then we are going to draw our vertical line also. And it's going to be like this. This is our vertical line. So first now we are going to be picking 10 10 cents. 10 10 millimeter sorry that's one one centimeter to each side as we have always been doing in the previous videos so we'll pick one one centimeter like this or 10 10 millimeter so we'll draw we're picking the one one centimeter is just to make our work neat and also to prevent us from making unnecessary mistakes that's confusions while drawing so we have we are going to draw like this so now we are going to be picking our front view from this side here that's this arrow a we are going to be picking our front view from here so as we can see the length of this place is 160 millimeter so we are going to pick more around 16 millimeter yeah that's 16 that's 16 centimeter we are going to be picking 16 centimeter so from there we are going to draw a straight line upward like this please make sure we are using let's make sure we are using tinting lines for this drawing so now as we can see the height here is 20 millimeter so we are going to pick two centimeter that's 20 millimeter we are also going to draw a straight line like this and let the straight line also go like this make sure it is the tinting lines please in order to avoid confusion so now what you can see in this place there is a breakage here which is 20 which is 20 um, millimeter so we'll pick our 20 millimeter from here and we can also see is it's also in this place so we'll pick another 20 millimeter from this side also so it goes like this like this we'll draw our straight line let's project it down a little bit then here also we are going to be doing the same thing for here we'll also draw the straight line let's project it down a little bit so now as we can see in this place there is a circle here so this the circle is actually in the middle of this of this 160 millimeter so we are going to be looking for the middle of this 160 millimeter which is 80 which is 80 millimeter so from that 8.80 millimeter we are going to draw as a center line we are not going to be using main line for this particular place so we are going to draw it up like that so from that from this point that is this point we are going to pick our compass the radius is 15 millimeter that is this circle the radius is 15 millimeter so the diameter is going to be 30 millimeter so we are going to pick our compass measure with 15 millimeter radius and draw and draw our circle and draw our circle showing this opening here that's this opening here so and again we can also see a an arc above this place which we can see that the radius is 30 millimeter so the diameter is going to be 60 millimeter so now we are going to be picking radius of 30 millimeter on our compass so we'll place it at the center also and with the radius of 30 millimeter so we'll place it here and also draw an arc like this so that's that for that and for here also we can also see that there are holes here that is like an hollow here so we are also going to be representing those holes that are in this place we can see that the diameter of those holes are 20 millimeter diameter and this place is also 20 millimeter diameter so from for here is going to be showing taking 10 millimeter part of this place and 10 millimeter part of this side so we are going to be putting it like this 
10 millimeter that's one centimeter here and one centimeter here and it's also going to be taking one centimeter in this place and one centimeter in this place so for these ones we are going to be representing them in short in short dashes because we can't see those holes from the front view you can't actually see them so we we'll represent them with short dashes like this to be like this like this done with the front view we can now proceed to the um, top view or the, or the plan is it that we call it the top view or we call it the plan so for us to draw the plan we are going to be projecting all lines that we have done on the front view we are going to be projecting all of them downwards so it's going to be like this we are projecting all downwards so it's going to be like this please let's make sure we are using tinting lines because there are some ones we are going to be we are not going to be taking all of them out just only few so let's draw like this we are going to be projecting downward like this like this Tinting lines, please. Let's make use of tinting lines. Project this place also downward. Like this. So we have projected all the lines downward. So now we are going to be drawing the plan. But before we draw the plan, let's take it out the front view first. It's going to be like this for the front view. Let's take this out. We are taking this place out also. The places we can actually see are the places we are taking out. So then the short dashes like this also. So here, yeah, we are trying to see here. If you can see here, okay, we are taking out this, 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 this. Okay. So we are going to be taking out the, the curve like this. That's that's for the top. So for this same or something like this. So now this place also, I'm going to be taking it out and here also like this. Like this. So we are taking out the um, front view. We are now going to be drawing the plan. So for the plan, as we can see, this particular length is 60 um, millimeter. So we are going to be measuring 60 millimeter first of all. That's the first thing we are going to be doing. 60 millimeter so we draw our straight line like this so now we have drawn our star in this place and as we can see in this place this is 30 um 30 millimeter so we are going to be picking 30 millimeter from this point from here from that 30 millimeter we'll draw our straight line like this like this Please make sure it's with thin lines. So now from this point, we can see that this place is this line, two lines are representing this circle that are here, and these two lines, two short dashes are also representing this circle that are here. But since we are viewing it from the top, we are going to be drawing the circle since we are viewing it from the top view. So we'll place our compass at this point here and draw. Picking one one centimeter diameter and uh, one 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 centimeter radius and that's ten millimeter of the re of radius. We are going to be drawing our circle like this in this place. So after we have done that, we are going to be drawing this particular place that come outside like this. That is this box. We are going to be showing it on this. On this drawing so it's going to be like this like this so I'm going to be thickening out this particular place I'll be thickening it out out like this 
so this other part also we are going to be having this curve that is like this that is this two curves that is like this and as you can see these two particular curve the radius is 20 millimeter that is the diameter is 40 millimeter diameter so we are going to be picking 40 m20 millimeter radius on our compass so after picking 20 millimeter radius on our compass we'll place it at this point like this and draw to this edge it's going to be stopping here like this then place it at this other edge also and draw like this like this so that's that for that this place also we are also going to be showing it this place that is like this so it's going to be this small circle here so it's going to go like this and and like this like this so that's that for this place so now we have picked all the points we can now take in out the places we are going to be needing so it should be like this finding value in this video please kindly give this video a thumbs up and kindly subscribe and also share with your friends who really need this video in their academics so now we have drawn our plan so we are going to be moving straight to the side view so to draw the side view we are going to be picking our angle 45 degree from this center of this our two axes here yeah, so we'll draw our 45 degree so we are going to be projecting all lines to the edge of this 45 degree from here we'll project like this project like this like this also project like this also and we project this also to the edge of this particular place so now we are going to be projecting all these lines upward so it goes like this please make sure you're using lines to draw this in order to avoid confusion data so this is it like this so now we are going to be picking out so we are going to have to project this upward a little bit more no. so just like this then we project this also to the side like this so now we are going, just going to be picking our points this is the side view here so we are going to be picking out the point because we have already drawn all that we need already so this is how we are going to do it this particular edge that is out here a place here so we are going to be drawing here like this like this so it's going to be like this like this so this is this edge that is here so we are going to draw this down part also as we can see we are going to be drawing all parts we can see here also like this we are actually drawing the side view this is where we are viewing it from so we we'll draw here like this draw here like this so there is actually a hole here so we are going to be representing that with short dashes so we we'll draw our short dashes like this draw our short dashes that's 
shots that she's we are taking it out already so this side we are, that is this one centimeter here we are going to take it out because you can see it here also we are going to take it here out also then for here for this middle is also only going to be short dashes also so this place not forgetting this place we are going to project like this to this place so we can actually see this hole that is here so it's going to be a short short dashes it's going to be a short dashes so that's that for that kindly hit this video a thumbs up subscribe and share with your friends you'll be needing this video thank you for watching